Hello everyone, welcome to the howto.org channel. To sign in Google Docs from our computer or laptop, we only have to enter the website docs.google.com. It will automatically be open with our Gmail account we're using. Here you can see my recent documents. If we want to log in with another account, click on the profile picture. Then click add another account. Here, at the end we click use another account. Now, we write the email and password we want to use. Google Docs can be used with any Gmail account. That's it, we're in this application. In the More button, we can create a new document. We can also use the templates that are here easily. They are editable. Finally, if we want to sign out of our account, click on the profile picture. Click on Sign Out. Here, if we want to remove it completely. At the bottom, we click on Remove an account. Then we click on this button. And finally click on Yes, Remove. There, that's it. In case we're using our smartphone to access Google Docs, the first thing we must do is install the application. We enter Play Store. Write Google Docs at the top. Then, click to enter. Here we click on Install. Now, we must wait for the download to finish. This is something automatic. The time depends on the speed of our internet. But it usually doesn't take long. Excellent, it's already installed. We can enter by clicking on Open. But we can also enter the application from the access icon that has been created automatically. We click on Docs. Now, click on Skip. It has opened with my Gmail account that I already have here on my smartphone. If we want to log in with another account, click on the profile picture. Then click Add another account. To use Google Docs, we just need to sign in with our Gmail account. We click on I agree. And that's it, we're in Google Docs. By clicking on this button we can create a new document. If we want to remove our mail from this cell phone, click on the profile picture. Then go to Manage Accounts on this device. Click on the email you want to remove. Then click on Remove Account. If you are sure, click Remove Account again. That's it. Thank you for watching our video, we hope it helped you a lot. Don't forget to subscribe and activate the bell to receive notifications of new videos.